Welcome back. Look, I ain't gonna even lie. FYBJ Main. You scared of Tay Savage, bro. Like, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Like, your whole story, the way you tricking on that man, the way you snitching on him, and you know what I'm saying, trying to say it's okay for you to snitch because he snitched on himself, which he didn't, and he ain't never got in front of no camera and said he killed nobody or did none to nobody. But you all this, I'm ducked down in the van, the glass cut my face. Sound like you a little traumatized about him blowing back at you. And it really ain't got nothing to do with blazing doll mama. But I be understanding your whoops, FYBJ, man. I understand you whoop because when you was claiming OTF, I didn't think I didn't think it was gonna be that easy for you to whoop the internet and make them think that you was OTF to so many people start hitting me up. Like, is FYBJ Main really OTF? And I'm like, y'all do know he not OTF. Like, I know y'all don't believe this, but because so many people believed the whoop and you start blowing up more and more, you just kept going along with it, going along with it, going along with it. I said, I ain't gonna say nothing. When you got into it with King Yellow, the whooped on him to keep your YouTube climbing and not, I said I wasn't going to say nothing. Now, I knew when you was doing the OTF thing, FBG Duck was probably, you know what I'm saying, rolling over in his grave, looking down like, look at this goofy, he doing the whoop. But you doing what you got to do to take care of you and your family. So I understand the whoops. You just be going too far with the whoop. Then when somebody take one of your whoops and do it better, then you even mad. But you can't get mad when you the one that started taking the whoops too far. Now let's get back to this whoop. The situation with you and Tay Savage. You said you said you 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 blew at him because you was trying to get your get back. Then he turned around and, and, and blew at you. But then you say he got hit in the nose. Now this is the crazy part. You say he got hit in the nose, but you ain't never say you was the one that shot him in the nose. See, I did my homework. Do your homework on how you kept saying he got shot in the nose, but you ain't say that you the one did it. I did my homework. Yeah, on your whoops. You feel me? It hit different, right? It hit different when you saying somebody John Wick and that they got hit in the nose and all that, but they had you ducking down in the van, hollering, screaming with glass cutting your face. Yeah, it do hit different when you had dreams about that and you scared of somebody like that. So the way I look at it is, you doing all this talking, telling, and snitching because you scared of them. That's that's the way I see it, bro. Um, I don't respect it. Um. It's a rat, like, you know, it's a Chicago street situation. It should have been left in the street. If Blaze and Dow decided she wants to come out and speak speak on that, then she could have, but bro, you can't, how is you speaking for her? Like, how is you trying to be her voice? And you trying to make it seem like you doing all this to Tay Savage because of him sharing her music, and that ain't got nothing to do with it. You doing all this because you whooping for yourself. But I'm finna let y'all, I'm finna let y'all go ahead and hear what J Main said. Savage, uh, but just by looking at the the stuff online, he's been through a lot of stuff, like uh, beating murders, um, allegedly, allegedly somebody's mom died or some shit like that. Uh, but this guy, he, he seems like a real serious dude. Then you said he looked like John Wick that night. Yeah, put it like this. Y'all call him Tay Sav, bro. I call him John Wick. Let's start there. The situation with him allegedly killing Blazing Dog Mama, shit. I I I know he killed that girl, Mama. Shit, he shot at me. I mean, I I, I'm not... I know he killed her mama because he shot at me, bro. You sound scared. <laughs> Bro, you sound scared for your life. Like, no lie, no cap. You sound real scared, bro. Like, if you if if you scared of Tay Sav, you should have just told him that. Don't don't try to whoop it and act like, you know what I'm saying, you could be a savage and get on the savage level that he on. If you scared of him, you just scared of him. But it seemed like to me, you trying to get him locked up and you want him back in jail. 
That's what it really seemed like. I ain't going to lie. Because who would go on in front of a camera and say this? So, okay. my cousin who you just speaking on, Lil Reese, right? I don't know Tay Savage from a can of paint, bro. It hit different when I don't know you from a can of paint. But you, la, 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 la. I don't know you, bro. It hit different when I don't know you, but you, la, 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 la. It hit different. So, long story short, keep in mind, me and Lil Reese, me and my cousin, bro, we had, we had, um, I'm gonna call it a family feud, bro. Because when you in tour with family members, I guess it's a family feud, bro. It hit different. So I see my cousin at the club, bro. After my cousin just came through and la 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 la. All right, man. So look, and Lil Reese is not your cousin, but look though, <laughs> you whooping the internet so hard, Lil Reese your cousin. He shot at you. You want to go get your get back, so you were shot at him. You didn't know Tay Sav at the time. You didn't know Tay Savage was in the car. Then he shot at you, but you saying he got hit in the nose, so y'all thought you thought he was dead. You saying this whole time. So now this the part, the, this the part that really killed me about the whole situation with J May, right? You knew about this whole story, this whole Tay Sav situation the whole time. You knew the whole time he was in jail and everything. But you turn around and say, oh, when he got hit in the nose, I thought he was dead. I ain't even know he was still alive. I ain't even know he was sitting in jail. J-Man, you capping, bro. Like, and I understand the woo. I understand the entertainment. I understand the algorithms. You shouldn't even want to be a rapper no more. You should just want to be a YouTuber because you, you entertaining. You lying on all your whoops, though. You see what I'm saying? It's a it it hit different when you lying with everything you say and you tricking the internet, but they believe it. I couldn't believe when people was asking me, "Is you really OTF?" I'm like, "Ain't no way they believe this," but they did. You see what I'm saying? So now all this story with the shootout and all this, you know what I'm saying? It's like, bruh. You want that man locked up because you scared and you traumatized. That's just the way I see it, bro. Like I said, I peeped all your other whoops. I wasn't going to get on your top. I'm like, okay, he whooping the system. I see the numbers running up. I'm like, okay, he whooping the system. People kept asking me to speak on it. I'm like, for what? The man, for, it, it's clear that he lying. But if y'all going to believe him, you know what I'm saying? Y'all going to believe him. And then he went as so far as to... That whoop ain't enough. What's the next whoop? Okay, I'm finna get in tour with everybody. I want to be in tour with Yell. I want to be in tour with Billy. I want to be in tour with Ruger. I want to be in tour with this person. I want to diss that person. I want to come at this person. I'm, oh, if you in Chicago, up, here go another whoop. Lil Reese, my cousin. I'm going to have a whole internet thinking Lil Reese, my cousin. You know what I'm saying? All type of, all type of stuff. So it's like, then Lil Reese said, yeah, you know. I know all my daddy used to beat up his daddy. We used to beat him up in the building. And see, I did my homework, Jay man. I did my homework. I peep your whoops, though. I know you whooping because it's easy. You ain't getting on there thinking like, I'm putting nobody in danger. Uh, I, I, I could potentially get somebody locked up. Uh, all you thinking is, I'm whooping these YouTube numbers. I'm trying to get back to where I was, and I'm going to keep getting these checks so I can take care of my family. That's all it is, bro. But, hey, salute. Do your thing. I say the only thing J. Main been honest about is him whooping to make sure he get a check to take care of his family. That's it. On the whole woo-wop. So, if you think he coming out here telling y'all the truth, being honest about who he related to, being honest about who he with and what gang he in and all that, if you believe all that, you crazy. So do your homework on J Main being BD, but also being BDK. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, do your homework on that. I, you know I did my homework. You know I did my research. You feel me? But J Main, you scatter that man. And Tay Sav say, a jury of 12 say he ain't did nothing, J Main. So it is what it is. Y'all keep asking me to speak on it. That's my take on it. Get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think, man. It's your boy, Buddha. I'm out.